Being able to schedule messages is a great feature, especially when you keep forgetting things that you have to remind other people of. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Canada Technology and in this video we are talking about how you can schedule messages on Slack. Now a lot of times you would want uh, to send a message but it may not be the right time and that's exactly what the Slack schedule message feature is for. So you can do it in either a channel or in a direct message. So I'm just going to uh, explain this in a direct channel and let's say you type in a message. So this is a random block of text that I'm going to schedule for this video. Now, once you're done typing uh, your message out, you will notice uh, that there are two options in uh, your send button. So if you press enter right now, this message will be sent. But if you want to schedule it, what you have to do is just click on this drop down and then you will see two options. So tomorrow at 9 a.m. or Monday at 9 a.m. These will change depending on the day and time you're trying to schedule your message. But you can just go ahead and click on custom time and this will open up uh, this new window. So uh, this works according to your time zone. So let's say I want to schedule this message for uh, 10 p.m. today. Uh, or if I don't want to set it for today, I can just set it in the future. So I can go all the way until November. Um, so you can schedule it for up to five months in advance. So I can select it on November 1st, 2024 at 3 or 2 p.m. or whatever time I want to select 7.30 a.m. and then click on schedule message. And that's that your message will now be scheduled. Now, uh, if you want to edit uh, any of your scheduled messages, once you've created a scheduled message, you will see uh, a, under drafts and send section, all of your scheduled messages will show up here. So uh, if I go to schedule, you can see that I have a message scheduled on my random channel. Now, uh, there are three buttons, three major buttons. One is for editing the message. So you click it, the message opens up in a text box, and then you can check this button to save your changes. Let's do that. And then we'll be redirected back to the screen. Now you can reschedule it. So you can change the scheduling time and then you can just send it right now using this button. Uh, there are several other options so you can cancel schedule and save it to draft or you can delete the message outright and that's how easy it is to schedule messages when using slack on pc scheduling emails on the slack app is also more or less the same as it is on the slack desktop version what you have to do is first up you can of course include it in any channels or in di direct messages so to schedule a message uh, we're going to type a message first so this is going to do something and then when you're ready with your message tap and hold the send button this will show up the schedule message options and then you can select whatever time or date you want to send your message on so let's say 17 july time will be 8 pm and then tap schedule message and your message will be scheduled to see and edit all of your scheduled messages go all the way um, over to draft and scheduled messages in here tap on the scheduled button and you'll be able to see your scheduled message from this point onwards you can edit it reschedule it or otherwise either cancel the schedule or delete the message altogether if you like this video consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such content can we make for you if you want to know more about tech, visit our website, candid.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter, and we'll see you in the next video.